Hello and welcome to my channel, Green Line Goddess Tarot. This is your daily reading for the 23rd of June, 2021. We are in the energy leading up to the full moon in Capricorn, which is occurring on the 24th, so tomorrow at some st stage. You should check when what time it is around the world. So let's see what's coming in for this beautiful, what energy is leading up into this beautiful Capricorn full moon. We have flipped out the King of Swords, so maybe some decisions to be made. It can also be very like an emotional detachment, actually. The King of Swords and the Capricorn energy can be, moons can be around your emotions. It can be all very, um, a sense of feeling, interestingly, I was saying emotionally detached, but we have the Ace of Cups, which is here is your emotions coming in here so it might be this kind of backward force the king of cups almost wants to be in the rational mind and the ace of cups is like the emotions are flowing over and so we have the hierophant coming in might be this kind of to and fro between the two of them how to find that balance we have the hierophant in the middle beautiful taurian energy right next to the emperor the big two strong big guns they look so similar their red robes sitting on the throne there. A lot of power between these two, between earthly power and soul and spirit power coming through. The Hierophant is your soul. So I feel like, uh, for you know, the soul is going to be coming in, giving you some very, very strong messages. The Five of Wands, there's conflict around. So, uh, and it could be re related to your own personal power or someone powerful around you. So it could be a boss or uh, a parent or it could be a client it could be someone you're working with it could just be someone that you meet like at a just say you you need to go to a, a bank and it's someone that's kind of an authority because there's a screen between you it can be anyone uh, but the Knight of cups is it's a nice energy of moving forward into looking at really listening to your heart here that is going to be the that is what the moon is wanting you to do and there's all these energies that are kind of trying to stop that really or block that uh, and, and it's kind of an interesting mix of going into that deep feminine energy, listening to your heart and then there's this other thing that's kind of saying, no, I need to be in the real world and be making decisions and taking action and um, focusing on work and doing things like that. And that can bring in a conflict around in itself with that five of wands. But it can be also that you are very clearly uh, sorting some stuff out in your world to do with people, people that you're dealing with, managing, looking at, working with, talking to. That's kind of what I'm getting is that it's like, no, but I've got things are drawing you into that world because you've got stuff to sort out and people to deal with. But your soul and the Ace of Cups and the Knight of Cups are going to come into this beautiful soul energy, connect to your heart. And so it's kind of an interesting balance. It's finding the balance between the masculine and the feminine. And with the soul and spirit sitting right in the center with the Hierophant, I think you will find that by grounding into yourself, connecting to your body, letting the energy travel down through your crown all the way down to the base into the earth and letting the energy flow, connecting into your soul because your soul will kind of clarify some of these confusing mixed messages of where you're wanting to uh, place your time and energy today. So really listen into that. That is where uh, you will get that the peace from blocking all the other noise of everything else out that is there. It's a noisy day. That's what I say for like voices. It's noise. Lots of things to be done, do, blah, 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 blah. It's like you need to find that space of silence and quiet to block that out and then just find out what really matters. So that's the energy that's coming in today. Could be a few petty quarrels, could be some tears, could people could be having these emotional outbursts, could be that kind of a day. It could be people just going, what, what, what's that about? Like not understanding, feeling quite cool and cold. It could be uh, everyone's kind of pushing their agenda in some or having their moment in some way and everyone's reacting and responding to that. So it's kind of a reactive day. So that's why I think, yeah, come back into the soul energy because ultimately it's connecting you to this Knight of Cups, which is moving in the positive new direction. What is your heart saying? And so those messages are going to be inside your body is what they're saying. 
So you need to kind of come back and ground back down and connect in very to that place of silence within your body to listen to those messages from your heart. So that's the energy for today or for the 23rd and look forward to seeing what's coming in with the full moon. So looking forward to seeing you then.